The Red Hot Rockies have Colin Ingram paying close attention. Yeah, I'm a huge Rockies fan. To every detail of every game. I'm such a huge fan of, like, the Americana. Including one over the weekend in Atlanta in which the announcers applauded the talents of the Braves' organs. And that got me thinking about how cool live organs are at baseball games and uh, how kind of bummed I am that Quartz Field hasn't had one in a while. So I sent that tweet. The tweet to the Rockies. How many retweets for you to buy an organ and let me be the Coors Field organist next season? The team responded, appropriately, 5280 plus three zeros, an impossible feat to match a joke of a tweet. But I, I didn't think it was that good of a tweet when I made it. Over 100,000 retweets, including the official MLB account, People want to see Colin try to win, even if they've never heard him play. And nobody had bothered to ask if I know how to play the organ. Colin is actually a record producer, knows a thing or two about instruments, but he is most definitely not, that much. not an organist. It's not quite it. Rick Morrell just cleaned up and installed this organ at the Sanctuary Church in Denver. But it, I think it has a certain uh, ambiance to, to the game that not every place has nowadays. He allowed Colin to um, break it in. And he can play the keyboard, but, he, you know, uh, he's not an organist, obviously, you know, but... Uh, you know, maybe if you call it a tryout, one that Colin most definitely does not expect to win. Well, one more, one more. We got this. But he does seem to have some raw talent, maybe enough for the Rockies to shave some zeros off that That's mile it. high goal. Just, just one inning, one inning playing Oregon at Coors Field. That sounds fair, right? <laughs> In Denver, Ryan Harrell, 9 News.